my name is Lily Kwong and I work in the development team at Be First, the Council's regeneration organisation. Barking and Degham has ambitious plan for growth and at the Council we're looking at how the industrial sites at River Road and Thames Road area could work more efficiently to deliver modern and fit for purpose industrial space for businesses. The Council, with the support of the Mayor of London, asked Be First and a team of designers and technical specialists to develop a high quality, multi-level industrial building at Creek Road to provide employment and opportunities for local residents and businesses. This will contribute to the long-term regeneration of the area by providing an example building that provides high quality industrial space while maximizing use of land. We would like to know what you think. Harry, our architect, would describe the proposal in more detail. Hello, I'm Harry Grocott from Howard Tompkins Architects. The building we're designing sits within the River Road employment area, an industrial district encompassing River Road and Thames Road in the southwest of the borough. It's home to a range of industries, from heavy manufacturing and warehouses to timber merchants and recycling. This area and the businesses within it play an important role in the economy for the borough and the wider city. The site itself sits on the corner of Longreach Road and Creek Road and has the potential to greatly improve the approach to the neighbouring Barking Riverside development to the east. Currently used to park buses and surrounded by temporary fencing, there is the opportunity here to bring the street frontage on this prominent junction to life. The overall aim of the project is to create an exemplar industrial development which will deliver viable, well-designed workspace in a high-quality building. The proposals are for a multi-storey building that is robust and capable of adapting to changing market forces. We also want to create a better environment for businesses and residents. This means introducing shop fronts along the street and a new local cafe. The building itself has two wings, arranged either side of shared yard decks. The vehicle ramp is located in the northwest corner of the site, while the goods lift bank is positioned in the centre of the north wing, which allows for efficient service distribution across the entire scheme. Car parking is on site, with the majority of units provided with a dedicated van loading bay and car parking spaces for staff or visitors depending on operation. Our proposed building locates larger light industrial units on lower floors, where direct vehicle servicing is easier, with smaller flatted factory units positioned higher up the building and accessed via goods lifts. Between them, these unit types will be able to meet the requirements of a wide range of potential tenants, from workshops, manufacturers and wholesalers, to breweries, bakeries and dark kitchens. The main vehicle and pedestrian entrance will be from Longreach Road on the south side of the site and will require some alterations to the existing highway. The bus stop on the north side of the road will need to be relocated further east and parking restrictions will be introduced. The car parking spaces within the building will reduce cluttering of cars around the site and create a more pleasant experience for pedestrians and cyclists. The building would deliver a range of amenities to its tenants and to the wider neighbourhood. There's a business centre at the site entrance, which includes a business lounge, meeting rooms and managed reception, while the breakout space at roof level provides an area for employees to relax and eat lunch in the open air. In addition, a new cafe open to the public will be provided on Longreach Road, within easy walking distance of the neighbouring Barking Riverside. Finally, full height glazed shop fronts will help to activate the street providing views into ground floor units and allowing tenants to trade directly with the public. This will also make the area a safer and more pleasant place. The building will set new standards for sustainability and the project will be delivering an ambitious BREAM rating of excellent. Two low maintenance green walls screen each end of the yard deck, which will be the main view for Barking Riverside residents looking from the east. These provide greening and along with rain garden planters promote wildlife in what is currently a barren brownfield site. The roofs of both wings will have extensive solar panel coverage. 
electric vehicle charging points will be provided and cycling to work will be actively encouraged through the provision of bike storage and changing rooms. While the proposals are ambitious and challenging, we're confident the building can set the standard for multi-storey industrial schemes in the UK and put the borough at the centre of that story. Thank you for listening to this presentation. We hope you find it useful. We're very interested to hear what you think about our proposal before we submit a formal plan and application. We're particularly interested to know if the scheme may be of interest to you as a local resident or local businesses. And if so, if there's specific facility or design element that you like. Please fill out the online survey available on the website or get in touch with us by 25th of September 2020. We look forward to hear from you.